Hey guys, what's up? What? It's got a motor. It's moto vlogging. <laughs> hey, what's up, guys? All right. Well, <clears throat> yeah, steering on this thing's terrible. to talk about a little thing that just happened. Um, my cousin um, is into motorcycles and he's not a blood related cousin. He married my, uh, my cousin. Uh, but anyway, so I guess he's my cousin by marriage. I don't know if that's entirely, I need to be going around the other way because I'm going to end up throwing all the grass in the middle and I'll choke out the mower. Um, anyway, my cousin is into motorcycles, as am I, and, uh, he had, well, he had two, he's only got one now, um, and he just recently let me ride his other one. I don't know if I've ever talked about, uh, my first ride, so I guess I'll begin with that, but I'm pretty sure I haven't mentioned that in a vlog yet, but, uh, he had a, uh, I think it was an 05. Uh, Yamaha R1 and oh my goodness that thing was a beast um, it's a uh, I had never ridden a, uh, a Japanese inline by a uh, leader bike um, before and so it was kind of a kind of a shock now my Buell was a leader bike I mean it's a 984 cc closest near makes no difference it was a leader bike um, but it was a V-twin, and as I'm sure most, if not all of you know, V-twins make their power differently than, you know, the, the Japanese in lines. Um, main, namely in the torque area. Um, now, the Buell engine that was in my, um, my, you know, my Lightning was, um, it was a Harley engine originally, and it had been adapted and modified by Buell to be infinitely better. Um, and Buell, of course, if you know Buell at all, you know they're now uh, making their own engines. Um, so, and those are even better. Those those make like 180 horsepower, and they're still V-twins. But anyway, back to the point. My, my Buell was, you know, it was fast, you know, it was it was crazy fast. Um, but when I got on that R1, you know, and just cracked it open, okay, I wasn't even redlining it. I th I'm pretty sure I had it close to full throttle, but I wasn't redlining it. I was I was shifting short of uh, its redline, maybe by a couple thousand RPM. But I got like, I cracked it open and then got up into fifth gear, of which it has six, and I was doing 145. So that was pretty crazy, but uh, he had he he has since sold it, and uh, the other bike he had, which I just rode, um, is a Harley. It's a Harley Sportster, and I gotta say, I'm not not crazy impressed with it. Um, it's it's a Harley, so you get the bad boy, you know. Um, attitude and the the cool riding position and all that great stuff that comes with owning a Harley but it's just kind of um, I don't know it is uncomfortable to ride for one because it's a it's a hardtail and it's really small like his his particular Harley is an 883 so the engines physically smaller I don't know if the actual block is smaller but I know the dis displacement is um, stick um the uh oh no ah! <laughs> attacked by flowers um he's got it lowered somehow i have no idea if you don't have suspension in the back how do you lower a bike but anyway it's low to the ground it's really small the pegs are like right under you almost i mean the pegs are like here ish and it's just I mean that the the air filter on the side of the V-twin like cuts into your leg, and I, it's just it's uncomfortable to ride. 
And I know his is the 883, which is the smallest of the Sportsters. It's like the baby Sportster. But, I mean, even so, um, it's, uh, it's not very fast. Um, I mean, I took it, I took my dad's, uh, Kawasaki Ninja, which I've been riding a lot recently, um, out with him on it. And, uh, it, uh, it kept up with it for the most part. I mean, obviously his was a bit quicker from the get-go, but it's just, so I'm not very impressed with the Harley. Um, I'm sure there are other Harleys that are better and, you know, I didn't, I didn't get a very long sampling, but I mean, I, I wouldn't spend my money on one. Now, like the 1200 Sportsters, maybe, maybe. Um, and that would only happen if I like, I was with a girl that was like, I like Harleys. Would you buy me a Harley so we can go ride together? And I would be like, yeah, maybe I'll buy you a Harley any day. Money ain't no object. <laughs> also in this dream, I, uh, I'm ripped. I got flowing blonde hair and a five o'clock shadow and a sword. And she's like an Amazon babe that like has a pet tiger. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. My win, my win, my win. I have no like definite pattern that I'm mowing this with. I'm going to end up mowing this yard again pretty soon because you see the uh, it's not cutting everything. Anyway. I just thought it'd be fun to make a vlog on the mower. I don't know why. Bleh. The c cool thing about riding mowers, lawnmowers is you, like, you could totally be like dead and keep doing it like bleh. I wonder if I could pop a wheelie. Let's try. No, let's try it again. Nope. I think it's a bit front heavy. It just doesn't have the power!